Hello everybody and welcome to today's webinar. It's great to have you all here today for one of our special topic webinars for group coaching and automation. I'm just gonna wait a few minutes to make sure everyone's in before we get going. Hi, Amy. Hi, everybody. How are we doing today? In the meantime, I'm just gonna add a poll into the chat uh, to, to see where everyone is up to in terms of the group coaching automation, whether you've used that feature before, whether you haven't. So I'll just share that now. We wanna make it as interactive as possible. So feel free to get your answer in. We are expecting more numbers today. We're gonna to have a good group of people. Um, so we're gonna try and get a few polls in there to see where everyone's up to. Cool, a pretty even split so far. People who have used the auto flow and haven't. That's all good. So we may be able to give the people who already use it some good tips today. And the people who, who aren't using it, we can definitely um, show you the power of that feature too. Cool, I'll just give it another minute or so and then we'll get going. We are going to be doing more webinars like this as well with some of those special topics. We have ideas for the on-demand features. Uh, this is obviously the group coaching automation today, but we have plenty of more webinars that will be coming too. Amazing. It seems like more people are leaning to not using the auto flow feature, which is all good. Uh, if you haven't an answered the poll already, feel free to get involved. Perfect, we'll, we'll get started then. There may be some other people joining, but that's no problem at all. So I wanna say welcome everybody to today's webinar. This is a slightly different webinar than, than we usually do on a Wednesday. So this is all about group coaching and automation. So a quick introduction to myself, if you don't know me already. So I'm Sam and my role at Everfit is the product specialist. So I speak with different businesses, coaches, and go through the functionality that we have on the platform. A quick overview of what we're going to discuss today. So I'm going to go through some of the use cases of the automation features, and then we're going to go and dive deeper into the auto flow and some of the other group coaching features on the web platform. And we're going to finish with a Q and A. So any questions that you have, uh, feel free to get them together, post them into the chat, and we'll definitely get around to those too. Perfect. So a quick introduction at Everfit, we have three main use cases. You may have seen this, um, slide before. Uh, the first one is the one-on-one -on -one training. The next one is the group coaching and the third one is the on-demand solutions. So the beauty of Everfit use cases is that you can mix and match these however you want. Um, so you can have the group coaching working nicely with an on-demand package. You can have the group coaching saving you time with the one-on-one -on -one training. But today we are going to specifically focus on the group coaching. This entails the auto flow feature, the forums, the leaderboards, Today's focus is gonna be all on the auto flow feature, probably our most powerful feature that we have in the platform. So what is the auto flow? The auto flow is the ultimate time saving feature when you want to train big groups of clients at once. You'll be able to build out programs and templates with workouts, with tasks and habits and messages to coach tens or hundreds of clients at once. The big thing with the auto flow as well as saving time, it keeps your clients accountable. Even at the one-on-one -on -one level, if you were to use the auto flow, um, you'd be able to have more touch points, more messages to keep your clients accountable than you ever would at the one-on-one -on -one level. Cool, so there's two ways that you can set up an auto flow. You may have seen this already. The first one is the by day sequence. This is where clients will join on day one and start running through that sequence. The other use case is the exact date sequence. This is where it will roll on a calendar format and just continue to go through. I'm gonna be going through these in a bit more detail with specific use cases of how they could work too. So the auto flow use cases, you'll be able to see that you can use these if you're any type of coach using the Everfit platform. So three examples that we're gonna go through today, even though there are a lot more, is the trial auto flow, the client onboarding auto flow, and then ongoing coaching auto flow too. Three really powerful use cases of how you can build those out. Just whilst we're um, waiting, I'm gonna add in another poll to go, to go into the chat. So this is what you think 
uh, what for an onboarding autoflow, what would you think the best autoflow would be to use? Cool. Amazing. So most people have gone for the by day sequence. There's no right or wrong answer with this. So there are use cases where you would use an exact day sequence with an onboarding autoflow, potentially for a challenge that starts at the beginning of a month or something like that. But probably the most common use case of using an onboarding autoflow would be a DAP by day sequence. This is as they go into day one straight away and they could do a one week autoflow or a two weeks autoflow, whatever you want, just with, full with loads of touch points at the beginning of their onboarding. Cool, I'm gonna dive a little bit deeper into these use cases then. So the trial autoflow. The benefits of using the autoflow for the trial is you're not spending loads of time on leads that may not convert. You can have a one month for seven day trial just built out, ready to go. So from the moment they sign up through our payment system, which we also have free trials available now for too, it will just start running. It has those touch points. It gives that one-on-one -on -one feel of coaching, but it just runs automatically for you. So you can focus more on your paid clients who are actually you know, paying you to, to coach them and just have these free trial leads running on a lead gen system through a free trial also flow. The next use case, the onboarding also flow. So I feel like I have gone through this, but it is the perfect way to get clients onboarded. You can add educational material. You could add welcome messages, anything that you want them to know from the beginning. It's always nice when you first sign up to a program or a challenge that you get those messages. You feel like you have a coach there to support you. Throughout this onboarding, you'll be able to have different tasks, messages throughout to get them all ready to go. Even assessments, if you want to start assessing them with forms and questionnaires, with uh, workout data, you can build those into the onboarding too, that they'll begin straight away. The ongoing slash coaching autoflow. So this is my favorite type of autoflow, as this is where you can start building out some low touch packages for ongoing subscriptions using the autoflow feature. It is perfect just to run on a calendar format. It's also really good if you want to take away some of those tedious one-on-one -on -one tasks that you may be doing with your one-on-one -on -one clients at the moment. So let's say a weekly check-in form, rather than assigning that individually to each client that you have, you can assign this to all clients at once. This will allow you to save hours per week and potentially scale your business and help even more people by getting that time back. Cool, I see a couple questions. Uh, we will get around to the Q and A's. So Robert said, my colleague Kate is trying to join. Uh, could you let her in? So I didn't have control of the, the admin access to let people in and out. So I'm not sure what that issue would be, Robert. And then are we able to take payments on everything? Yes, you are. So we will be going through that in some more detail. And Monica, how can you do that? So the ongoing coaching auto flow, I'm gonna go through and actually build on the web platform. So that is what we're gonna go through now. Cool. Amazing, I'm just gonna share my screen. And we're gonna to go to the auto flow page. So this is the web platform. I'm sure everyone's seen this before, but where you find the auto flow is on the left-hand side on the auto flow page here. You can add new auto flows whenever you want and you'll be able to get that choice of a by day sequence, which is really good for onboarding and uh, when you're running programs that people are joining at different times and the exact date sequence too, which is great for those ongoing auto flows that you just want to run. Really great for check-ins, daily habits that you want to send out to big groups of clients at once. So the one I'm gonna show you how to build today is an ongoing membership. So for the ongoing membership, I've chosen exact date sequence. You'll be able to add workouts or programs for those specific days. So I'm gonna go in and add this upper push workout here. I'm gonna add a leg day on Friday that all my clients are gonna be doing. And then we're also gonna add in a lower body workout there. And then a hit to batter workout there too. We have time saving functionality where you can drag and drop those workouts. You can also copy and paste full weeks and delete them too. So this is the workout schedule. You can build this out for a whole year in advance if you wanted to and just have that running on autopilot 
you could build out a week at a time whilst new clients are joining. Um, so there's no need to go too far ahead. You can pretty much build this as it goes too. The tasks and habits. So you'll be able to add those tasks that you want your clients to be repeating, whether it's weekly or daily tasks. So the first example is the habits. When you add your habits, we have a list that you can choose from. But if you feel like we're missing any, you can create your own whenever you want. You can add the emoji, the name of the habit, the goal value, whether it's times, minutes, servings, cups, and you can have it set up as a daily habit or a weekly habit too. So I'm just gonna go back here and choose a drink water habit. You just simply choose the end date. You could go a whole year in advance if you want to. You can set a reminder to keep your clients accountable and then save and close that. And you'll see that that drink water habit has been added to this auto flow. So every client who's in it will get that drink water habit every single day. Let's say you wanted a weekly check-in form on a Friday. You could add in a weekly check-in. You simply choose that form. You can set a reminder again if you want to, and then set that up as a repeat task for 26 weeks. Similarly with progress photos, with body metrics, with general tasks, which is great for sharing content, you can build it into this flow that everyone on a low touch subscription is receiving or all of your one-on-one -on -one clients, rather than repeating the same stuff all the time, you can build it into one of these auto flows and just add everyone into it from the moment they're onboarded. The final piece of the auto flow is the auto messaging. So we have two types of auto messages. So one is the announcements. This is great for your daily tips, your motivation. If you have any broadcasts that you want to send to everybody, you'll be able to add images and videos to these two. The next type is an in-app message. So this is where you can go hi and then first name, and you could say, how's your week gone? And it will come across as a personalized message, even though it could have been sent out to hundreds of clients at once if you wanted to. So they're the three main features of the auto flow. I'm gonna to touch upon some of the additional features within the auto flow and outside of it for group coaching. So one is the leaderboards. So the leaderboards you can connect to any forums that you want to. To add a leaderboard, it's as simple as connecting that forum that you want and then adding it here. So we have eight different types of leaderboards that you can choose from. We have percentage weight change, total weight change, highest volume li lifted, cumulative volume lifted, total number of reps, total steps, and then also two accountability ones here for total tasks completed and total workouts too. So you can simply choose the type of leaderboard that you want. You can have incentives connected to this if you wanted to and really drive the engagement through these leaderboards. You would just choose the end date. And once that's connected to the forum, that will start running and clients will be able to see where they are in that leaderboard. So I've just mentioned the forums there. Where you find the forums is just two below the auto flow on the left hand side. You'll be able to build out all of your forums that you want. So you could have a full forum, you could split it up into smaller groups too. We say it's very similar to a Facebook group where everyone can post, everyone can like, comment, you can pin posts, you can tag people too. We've also just recently built out the functionality which is part of the auto flow to schedule those forum posts too. So you can simply choose the date in advance that you want this message to go out at and it will just it will just post for you on that day so some other group coaching features before we finish for a q a and um, we are building out some new functionality at the moment uh, so just to give you a bit of a teaser is the group chat so this is currently in beta testing at the moment uh, but it's very similar to that whatsapp group chat you'll be able to see that in the inbox um, so that is one just to keep everyone excited for and we do expect that to be launched within the next week or so. We are also building up broadcast messaging, which is gonna be in real time. So very similar to the auto flow, um, but it's gonna be in real time. You can send a message to a bulk number of clients whenever you'd like. 